So some people have asked us how to create an audio file um, and then import that audio file into PowerPoint. So what we're using is Audacity and you can download Audacity. Um, let me bring this across really quick. Um, if you go to audacity.sourceforge.net you can download Audacity for free. Um, this is Audacity, so when we record, when we download Audacity, um, pretty much the only thing you need to do is launch the program, and right up here we have a record button. Um, I'm going to go ahead and click record, and we can see that the waveform is forming um, of the items I'm recording, and I'm going to hit stop. That's pretty much all you need to do other than do a file export choose wave if you're going to save this and import it into a PowerPoint um, give it a name and save it before you do that you could come in and listen to it if you decided maybe this part of it right here needed to be deleted you could highlight hit the delete key on the keyboard and delete that part of it out um, again if maybe you didn't like the last part of this you could delete it out putting your playhead there clicking record and starting again noting that we do have another audio track that's forming down here but when we save it it's going to be one file I'm going to take this file that I've created so far and I'm going to do an export and I'm going to create a new folder on my desktop called voiceover and we're going to call this test.wav and when you get this pop-up here, you could put your name in as artist name, but you can just go ahead and leave all that and click OK. It's going to mix everything down to a single mono channel. And we click OK. If we look now out on the desktop here at the voiceover folder, I have a test.wav file. Next, I'm going to take that file and import that into a PowerPoint. So I've opened up my PowerPoint presentation and under the insert, so you can go to the insert at the top, audio from file, or under the insert under the home tab at the top, under insert, and you can't really see it because it's a little cut off, but there is an audio from file option as well we want to choose the audio so before I choose this audio I'm gonna actually do a quick save as um, so we don't have any problems with this document so I'm gonna go into my voiceover folder and save this as presentation one and I'm going to then go back and in this particular um, slide I'm going to insert an audio from file I'm gonna move this over so that way you can actually see the audio from file and we're gonna go to that voiceover folder and choose the test.wav and click insert now that we've done the insert under the format audio tab we want to on start so under this audio options we want it to click we want it to start automatically and we want to hide the icon during show so this icon will not display now when the PowerPoint actually starts so this is a way to create a audio file so I'm actually going to do a save um, this is a way to create an audio file and using audacity saving it and inserting it into a PowerPoint if you have any more questions, you can contact me at W-I-L-L-I-A-S-A -L -L -I -I at U-P dot E-D-U.